Have you ever dreamed of being famous or want to pursue a career that has you in the spotlight? You might have the talent and work ethic, but do you dread the idea of talking in front of a crowd? We were just talking with Alex Clark, who is currently on tour, and he brought up stage fright. Stage fright, otherwise known as performance anxiety, affects many people ranging from athletes and celebrities to politicians and CEOs. Is this phobia preventing you from reaching the stars? Here are eight signs you may have performance anxiety. One, your hands get cold and clammy. You know this is the start to stage fright when you have difficulty holding the mic, constantly have to wipe your hands and need to reapply your deodorant. Anxiety is responsible for activating your stress response, which in turn causes you to perspire more. Even though you might not actually be in danger, your brain receives the same signal to make your skin release your body's water instead of your kidneys. That way, when you have to defend yourself, you don't have to stop to urinate. 2. You experience nausea and stomach problems. We get stomach problems for a lot of reasons, whether it's because you ate something bad the other night or you're experiencing an infection. But when you're stressed about giving a presentation, it might have you running to the bathroom too. This is called irritable bowel syndrome, which commonly affects many patients diagnosed with anxiety and depression. The nervous system partially controls the colon, so when we're stressed, this can irritate our stomachs, resulting in cramping, diarrhea, or constipation. 3. Your knees, lips, and voice tremble. Do you feel weak and shaky before public performances? Even if your body doesn't resort to trembling, people who experience stage fright often get muscle tension. When your stress levels go up, it stimulates your nervous system, which controls your body's muscles. This explains why you don't feel in control in your body when your nervous system is on overdrive. 4. Your throat and mouth turn dry. Ever wonder why you see bottles of water provided to the president or other public figures when they're giving a speech? Feeling anxious before performing can reduce the flow of saliva in your mouth. On a related side note, if you take antidepressants because of your anxiety or depression, the medication can also give you a dry mouth as a side effect. 5. Your heart rate goes up and out of control. If you've ever watched Mean Girls, you'll know that epic moment where Katie says that she feels like her heart is about to fall out of her butt. That's actually what people with stage fright commonly feel too. Why? Because when you feel stressed, this also activates the same areas of your brain that regulates your cardiovascular functions. Shortness of breath, a tight chest, and your heart rate escalating are all symptoms that frequently occur simultaneously. 6. You experience visual irregularities. Ever see in cartoon shows where the character bangs his head and he starts seeing stars? Well, this isn't just a cute animation idea. When people experience stage fright, they may have vision problems such as seeing stars, shimmers, and fogginess. When you're stressed, your senses become heightened, which include your vision. 7. You stutter when you deliver your speech. There's an ongoing myth that anxiety is the root of all stuttering, but sometimes it's actually just a hereditary thing. That's not to say, however, that stress does not cause stuttering, because it definitely can. Psychology professor Tedra Walden states that stress increases the likelihood of stuttering, aggravates stuttering that is already present, and may be one of the reasons that stuttering is maintained over time. If you struggle with this problem, there are treatment options to consider, such as slowing down your speech by regulating your breathing. 8. Your mind goes blank the very minute you step on stage. No matter how many times you've rehearsed your speech, the minute you get up to deliver it, you might find your mind drawing a blank. That's why it's helpful to have note cards in front of you. When we feel anxious, our minds have a tendency to experience blockage, which prevents our thoughts from flowing freely. One helpful strategy you can use is the memory palace technique. Sounds fancy, right? But it's as easy as pie. Even Sherlock Holmes uses it. Start off by associating parts of your speech you wish to remember with parts of a location you are familiar with. This can be your home, school, or office space. The only way this exercise will be effective is if you can visualize yourself walking through this place as you assign each part of your speech to a specific room. Tired of experiencing some of these symptoms? Then visit itsalexclark.com to see a pro overcome stage fright himself. Alex Clark is a seasoned YouTuber and performer who is currently on tour with his comedy act. Stage fright can make life awfully gloomy. Why not spice it up with some good laughs from this talented storyteller? Thanks for watching!